So recently I covered some um, ways that you could flip a coin or roll a dice uh, using just a simple Google search or using your iPad and using Surrey. Now if you want something a little more intensive there are some other websites out there that do this pretty well. So for example for flipping a coin there's this neat little one when you come to it you can click and it kind of animates the coin flipping. Now we, one neat thing about this is you can actually come down here and you can actually pick different colors for the background. So if you have a certain school color, you can kind of pick that or something that just is kind of fun uh, for your classroom. Now if you want something a little more realistic, you, there's this website right here, uh, virtualcointoss.com. When you come here, you'll actually see it shows a coin, but when, when I click it, it actually makes a little coin flip sound. Now one nice thing about this is that when you come to the website, it actually keeps track of your current session. So you can kind of watch it go as it's kind of going. It's pretty neat. Now if you want something a little different, random.org has a coin flipper. But the neat thing about this is you can pick how many coins you want to flip. But also you can pick all kinds of different coins uh, from within here. I find students really like this because they get to customize a little bit what they want to pick. But if we get down to the good old United States here, you can see there's lots of different options that you can pick from within here. So maybe I do the half dollar, and I can say flip coin. And it comes up and it's kind of neat. So I can say flip again if I want to kind of keep going. Now if I want to look at dice rolling, there's two kind of neat websites here, one from random.org again. This one's kind of nice because I can pick how many dice I want to go, but I can go <laughs> pretty far here. So let's say I'm going to do three dice. I can say roll. And nice and quickly, it gives me three uh, dice as roll. So this is great in a classroom that maybe uh, you've had some board games and the dice have gone missing. No need to worry. You can have a website that does it for you. Now, sometimes we need something a little more intensive than just a six-sided die. And there's a website here. This one's kind of neat. Um, I'll put the, the link to this one in the comments section here so you don't have to try to find this. Um, but when you come here, you can actually pick different kinds of dice. So maybe if I pick a 10-sided dice, I can come into this. And the dice comes up, and when I click it, it randomly does it for me. So those are just some neat websites that you can use if you need to do a simple coin toss or just something like rolling some dice. Thanks for watching and have a great day.